Welcome to episode 22 of Renovation Reality here in Brookhaven, Georgia. Now, I'm not saying it's the final episode because remember, this is Renovation Reality and we still have a few things, nuts and bolts to clean up, punch out lists, and we want you to see the entire process. But tonight, we're gonna show you how it's all come together and you get to be part of our renovation reveal. You're gonna follow a few friends, family, clients, coworkers through as they get to see it for the first time. All right, Karen and Steve, come on in. Wow. Wow, Colette. Do you remember what this, this was? doesn't yeah. even look like the same dining this room. This was the dining room. This was the dining room. Now it's the office sitting room, but when it goes on the market, it can be a dining room again. It's fabulous. All right, so here's the entry. All right. Totally different. Very different. Ooh, nice, nice. Dining room over there. No hallway to nowhere. Remember the hallway was right, right here? Right. That's right. And now we got space. Was the dining room? Yes. <laughs> Welcome, CJ. Come on in. Come on in. Oh my gosh. All right, D. Come on oh, into gosh. the front entry. Oh my gosh. Big change, right? Huge change, right? I love it. Laura's is one of my best friends. Oh my gosh! Ah! I'm gonna cry. This is gorgeous. <gasps> oh my pants. This is amazing. What's your block countertop? How yes. many slabs did it Two. Two. And, and a contractor done. put it together. Oh. Of course, I like the built-in stereo system. You know. I know, the Sonos. The Sonos yeah, system uh, is installed. They love it. So there was a wall here. Yes. And now, so, if you remember, we had all those posts on the cabinets. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The structure. Yeah. Right. So now you've got a So now we have the steel. Well, it's all steel beams. All steel beams. I'm still in shock over the space that was here because I remember a few months ago having a glass of wine sitting on that fireplace and there was, this was all gone. So where did the house, it stopped right there? It stopped right here. So we always had this space. You just see it was different. It was tight. Now we've got this open. Goes out to a new room which is now the family room. You've got the dining area, family room, media center, but two sets of walls. So in these 1960s Cape Cods, you never had high ceilings. No. Never once. Now we've extended it so it feels taller. This feels like I am in Seaside. You know, it's all about eliminating clutter, right? Mm -hmm. 
guess when you've seen a thousand houses, you can see all these little cool ideas. This tile is gorgeous. Check it, feel it. That's what I was, I was going to do that, but I was like, is that weird? <laughs> well, it's like, it looks like a rug, but it does. It's it looks like a cute sisal, but it's mm -hmm. really not. All right, you've seen John St. Martin before, the contractor on this project. He's the one who got it all done. Now, John, why is this one of your favorite projects? Well, frankly, uh, and the obvious reason is the client. Loved working with her, and the design was outstanding from Ware & Associates. And I love just taking something old and making it brand new, making it phenomenal with my own touches. Now, is there anything that you would change in this project? Absolutely not. Believe it or not, this is one of the few that I've really looked back and said, wow, everything's just perfect. You have just experienced episode 22 and you can see how beautiful it has all come out. Now, it's taking a lot of time, a lot of effort, a lot of money, which renovations usually do, but it's worth it. It's like giving birth. It's a little painful, but the end product could be perfect. Now, there are a few things that we still have to deal with, and we'll keep you posted on all, all that, but hopefully you've enjoyed walking through, getting a feel for the renovation, and had a little fun at our party as well. Now, make sure you are sending this link off to friends, family, clients, coworkers, anyone thinking of doing a renovation like this because it's a lot of work, a lot of stress, a lot of blood, sweat, and tears. <laughs>